Good morning and welcome back to another Board Shorts of Kirby Smith. I'm Kirby Smith and I'm standing here with Miss Allison, who is the owner operator of Dreamcatcher Horse Rescue. Good morning. Good morning. How Kirby. are you doing this morning? I'm doing great, thank you. So we're here at Dreamcatchers. Can you explain a little bit about what you do out here? Yes, so for the past 18 years, we basically have been taking in horses in need. Um, they usually came from animal control in Lake County or owners that just can't afford to keep them anymore. Um, and more recently, ones that have had a major medical issue and the owners just can't afford the surgery, so they would have to put the horse down. So we take them in, we rehab them, Sometimes we adopt them out, and sometimes we keep them here as a sanctuary horse. And I'm assuming that this uh, operation is not just self-funded, but you're looking for volunteers and sponsorships. That's absolutely correct. Um, as I'm sure most people can understand, it's a very expensive um, pastime. <laughs> and we do love our communities come in and volunteer. We have a lot of seniors that come in that need something to do, gives them a new lease on life. We have a lot of teenagers that come in and do the community service hours for school. We also do take community service people who need the hours for probation. Um, and we also need sponsors. We love to get sponsorships on the horses. They can actually come out and see them and groom them if they want to. So you're talking about um, having people come out and do community service, but it's more than just that. It's, it's it's learning how to take care of an animal, it's learning how to groom a horse, cure a horse, saddle a horse, um, ride a horse, correct? Correct, yeah. So basically the, the volunteer work, a lot of it is helping to feed and clean. So it is dirty, sweaty labor work. But it's a lot rewarding of, It's work. very rewarding and it's very therapeutic, which a lot of people are not, from, you know, they, they want to do it, but don't know where to go to do it, or they pay a therapist. Come here and volunteer instead. It's so much more fun. Being a uh, grandson of a farmer, I can tell you that being out with the animals and being in the nature is therapeutic. Um, I would suggest that anybody that would like to come out, just come out and experience what it's like to um, take care of an animal. Absolutely. How do people get a hold of you? Well, if you're on Facebook, just look up Dreamcatcher Horse Rescue in Claremont and you can message us through that. Okay, and do you have a phone number for someone to call you? We do. It is 407-702-8332. If you want to know what it's like to be on a farm, come on out here to Dreamcatch your horse rescue. It's more than just horses. It's a petting zoo. Get your community services hours. Come on out. Donate. Donate your time. Donate your money. Bring your family out. This is a wonderful place to be. As you can tell, we have a good friend of ours behind us. Uh, learn to pet him, learn to cure on him. Hey, buddy. Whatever you do, just enjoy your family, enjoy your friends, enjoy nature. Enjoy the wildlife. That's what it's like. Real Florida, real close. Just be good to each other. Come out and enjoy the event. <laughs> and that's all we have for Board Shorts of Kirby Smith. See you next Wednesday.